forecast. It's chilly out there already below freezing in Birmingham. A lot of places already in the 20s to the north of town. Tuscaloosa is sitting at 32 with a mostly clear sky. Dew point down at 25. That's an indicator of the floor for the thermometer tonight. And as the number comes up just a little bit, some high thin clouds coming in from the west. We're not going to settle too far below 30 around most of Tuscaloosa County tonight. But Jasper, Aniata, Coleman, Haleyville, Arab, Pell City, Aniston, and even though there's no report from Gadsden's airport, you better believe it's in the 20s there. 31 to 30 degrees from Birmingham South, where those are current temps. Again, the high thin clouds to the west often help to level the temperature off a little bit, and I think that's going to happen through the overnight hours as most of us will wind up bottoming out very close to where we are right now. The next couple of hours in Birmingham, we're around 30 to 31 degrees. Tomorrow morning, just a few degrees cooler than that, about 29. Scattered frost expected. And then into the mid 50s on Wednesday afternoon, a partly to mostly sunny sky, a light southeast wind, and the weather starting to feel a little bit more comfortable going through the middle of the day with that sunshine breaking through those high thin clouds. This is the Arctic high that came blasting through here Sunday night into Monday. It came from Canada. Now it's over along the east coast. Over the next two to three days, this thing doesn't move that much, but it weakens. It starts to lose some of that impact. Still impactful enough to give us one more freeze early Thursday morning before things really start to warm up with more of a south to southeast flow going into Friday and Saturday and Sunday. That, by the way, is also where that chance of some showers will come in. High temps back up close to 60 by Thursday. That may feel like a pipe dream, though, tomorrow morning as cold as it will be around here with most of us sitting in the mid to upper 20s. Saturday, Sunday, and Monday, Christmas Day, a chance of some showers are back in the forecast. I think now Saturday is looking good, whether it be last minute Christmas shopping or the uh, Birmingham Bowl looking good. Christmas Eve, a small chance of showers. More widespread rain is likely on Christmas Day with a high in the lower 60s. How much rain are we talking? Seven to 10 day rainfall is going to vary from place to place, but I think we're in pretty good position to have at least one half to one inch of rain over most of north and central Alabama. And as always, a few overachievers could get up to two inches cold in the morning. 29 in Birmingham to start the day. These may not be the formal lowest temperatures on the board here, but 25 Jasper, 22 at 6 a.m. in Gadsden, about 26 for Moody, and in the mid-20s as far south as Chilton County, too. The rain starts to move in by Saturday, maybe a few showers Saturday night. Sunday, Christmas Eve, a little bit better chance of a brief shower, and then Monday and Tuesday looking quite a bit wetter and still mild. Well, the former Hoover.